You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! All right, yo, man, 15 Minutes of Fame. Top tier Fetty. That's why I call you top tier Fetty, man. You do top tier shit. I do? Come on, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. I got to I mean, hear from hear from y'all. I hear they ain't steady. You ain't never been consistent. Like, you just, you're a very clever yeah, guy. Yeah, my pen, I always had a pen, though. Yeah. I just had to, you know, you got to start adding the entertainment factor to it. So, What, what, what do we got to do, man, to get you on Gnome or get you on Summer Madness? It's like the material that you have is Summer Madness Gnome worthy. It, it, you know what I learned, though, bro? This shit ain't, I don't ever hold that against, like, you know how many niggas is, is nice like me that deserve a shot? There's yes, a lot of us that deserve a shot, bro. So I don't never complain. And most of the niggas that's on the stage, bro, they kind of deserve it, bro. They nice. Some niggas fuck up, whatever, but I don't, I'm not unrealistic like I'm better than everybody out here. So it, it's just, I'm just a realistic person, so I'm not going to chase something. I used to chase this shit, but I don't chase this shit no more, bro. Right, right. You just do it for fun. Mm-hmm. Put it back. Do you think it's because your hat it matches it your hoodie? Hmm? Just, do you think it's a hat matches your hoodie? Do you think if you would have had on a purple and hoodie? And the shoes. And the shoes. <laughs> do you right. think you match too much? Nah. Maybe if you had on a purple hoodie and a green hat and orange sneakers, you know, just something to make you stand out, you know, so people could actually hear the fire shit that you say. Sometimes that's what it is. You know what, that, right? What do you mean? I don't understand what you're saying. Like S- Sometimes you're, you're a cool motherfucker, man. Oh, so people fuck with me and they don't even care about what I, how I rap? Like. No, because sometimes people dress in a weird way and it makes people pay oh, attention to them more. Like, get on some daylight shit, like, like dressing wise, basically. I remember do daylight to, saying... You say you do something to draw attention. But this is the thing about that, bro. But not in a bad way. You don't want to change who exactly. you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who I am, bro, I'm a shit talker. I'm from Harlem, bro. I'm a shit talker, bro. And, bro, I got... Bro, I just got people... Niggas know what I'm saying. People connected to me. I don't want my shit to affect somebody else. Shit, that's all. That's 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 right here connected. If I to ever me. decide if to you battle, understand what I'm you're saying, gonna bro. write for me. I don't. Want, I, I, if I if you understand, like, I don't want my shit to affect her shit. That so I don't be wilding. Over, I don't be doing shit. To, I don't be doing the extra shit like I used to. I don't know if you remember, but I used you to trying be to be Bobby niggas. Brown and Whitney? Is that what you telling me? Nah, that's that's <laughs> wild. That's different. <laughs> You trying to be Bobby Brown to Whitney? I'm trying to stay out the way, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I used to be a problem starter. I used to be a sh- like, I created a lot of enemies in this game, bro. So I know what I did. And a lot, it's not even like it's enemies to where like we enemies. It's enemies that that's not saying that we enemies. Right, right, just, right, right. That's how life is. I'm a realistic person. I'm gonna get it regardless, bro. But you enjoy doing it regardless. Yeah, I enjoy. Yeah, yeah. Right. You you enjoyed the pro- you enjoy the process of battle rapping. This part. Yeah. Okay. I don't enjoy the, the preparation. Okay. Ah. Uh, okay. Before. I only but, had two battles last year. This is my first battle this year. Damn. I only had two battle, two one rounders last year. You're a very yeah. talented brother, man, and, and I've been in this culture for a long, a long time, and I see a lot of talented dudes, and I'm like, yeah. fuck, why? Why can't he get twenty thousand dollars? He bro, just gave twenty thousand dollars worth of material. Than just the talent, bro. Like, yeah. Like, like, listen to this. I had. I'm a, I, I'm a scout for the uh, Crucibles, right? Shout out to that because that says a lot about you. I had two picks. So, it's man, I got a team full of niggas, MTO. We like 30 deep. I got mad niggas I'm cool with. I got mad niggas. It was hard for me to pick the person because this this uh this year niggas had to uh pay their own way to get there and and pay for their own hotel shit. So, it so I only say that it's mad nice niggas I could have picked. Right. But it take more than just being nice in this game, bro. And I had to learn that. How hungry to are you? At... Or, or how, or how like stable are you? Okay. Uh-huh. You understand what I'm saying? Like, a lot of niggas can't, and I'm not shitting on nobody, but niggas can't just get up and get a hotel. A lot of niggas don't even know how to. Right, 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 I don't, right, right, I, don't, right. I don't never get my own hotel. Like, <laughs> I don't never book my own shit. I, I don't think I ever booked my own shit before. That's yeah, you, you, for. you right, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shout out but to But it ain't an easy job, bro. It's, what I'm trying to say is not an easy job for them to place niggas. Like you said, how could we get you on known? That's a process. I wouldn't want... If they see... If, 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 if P or Smack one of these niggas say, yo, you want to be on known this year? I'm not going to just jump at that. Because one... It's got to make sense. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. not one of them niggas that, yeah, put me on known right now. No. Let me battle one of these niggas. Then let me battle one of these niggas. Let me get my name up. Then put me... Let me prove... I don't want to just go up there and be like, what the fuck he doing up there? Do, 
do you think the right opportunities were presented to you and it just didn't happen? Nah, I don't think that. I okay. Think, so you don't think you had the right opportunities yet? No, I don't think this. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna try to tell you as quick as possible. Mm -hmm. Y'all remember when I was on the come up? It was the PGs. Mm -hmm. I'm from the PG class of niggas like Dougie, niggas like Twerk, niggas like Rada, Jack Boy, uh, Drugs, uh, Gaddafi, Bitch. Like I'm, I'm in that group. So think of them niggas now. Think of those mm -hmm. names now. I'm the only one who never got like a, a extra push. I, I never got the Born Legacies and shit like that. I was always the nigga. So and at that time, that's when the DMV shit started. So it was like a you I was just a mix? piece to niggas puzzled it and I don't want to say it like to put niggas on because that's nothing not, I don't even give a fuck about what niggas did to that whole DMV shit I would have did this too <laughs> so I'm not mad at that but I just got caught up in that and battling them niggas because it was they turn mm -hmm. so I was just the nigga that I feel like to the staff or whoever I was just a nigga that they knew was going to come with the work to get they peoples the good looks I'm not choking and shit like that so that's what I felt that time, and then after that, I, I'm not a nigga that's calling them, asking them for place either. I'm not that type of person too, so I do kind of get caught in the mix. Pete told me, Pete told me out his mouth like, "Yo, I kind of fucked up with you." I kind of he he told me that through the DMV. I, no, not he didn't say that, but he okay. said he kind of fucked up where he could have put me in a. He said he said Yo, he kind of dropped the ball with me, but they also told me that certain battles that I took I shouldn't have took or whatever shit like that. So it's just a. It, it ain't that easy, bro. It's easy for the undeniable niggas. It's easy for niggas like Twerk, niggas like Easy, niggas like, like it's easy for like Geechee. Some people just have yeah, that. Yeah, bro. It some of us gotta work harder, bro. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Some of us gotta work harder. Some of, some of these niggas wake up in the morning and do this shit the day of, bro. It's not me. Yeah. <laughs> but like so, I always say, man, you know I always said it for years, man. Like you just one of those guys. Yeah, I appreciate that. You though, know bro. your pen is really incredible, yeah, man. Like yeah. you really be saying some fire. Yeah, and I, and I and I yeah. appreciate that shit that yeah. people recognize that shit, yeah. bro. I do. Uh, and I and that's what I do it for, bro. You feel me? Now, fifteen minutes of fame. You are now listening to fifteen minutes of fame. Radio. Let's go. Let's go.